Yeah, best guys, welcome back, man, to the channel. Welcome back again, man, to the series F1 2020 My Team Career Mode, round number 21 out of 22 in Brazil. This is the race, uh, man, still presented by you, uh, presented by me, Golza and Lorambuto, aka Elka Ekta SA, this little guy. And I'm gonna guys, I want to come in because this part, and thank you guys so much for support, man, remains out to me. So, yeah, this is probably like actually late at night. Um, yeah, then let me just take a time. Yeah, it's 20 past 12 on the 4th and the 4th of August 2020. So, yeah, we're pushing, we're pushing, man. And yeah, like the grind never stops. And yeah, I'm just praying that I can present. Uh, I don't know why I said to present to you, present to you, but yeah, I just want to present. Yeah, just good gameplays, man. And yeah, uh, according to my le level at this point, so yeah. This is what I can give you guys, but probably as I continue or as I go on now, yeah, it will be a little bit difficult and a little bit competitive as well. So, yeah, but so far I'm happy with everything's happening, and yeah, let's get it done. Welcome along then to the place where heroes and history are made. It's where the 2008 title was decided in the final corner. And it's the place, a year later, that Jensen Button stormed through from 14th on the grid to claim his one and only Drivers' Championship. It's into Lagos, and it's time for the Brazilian Grand Prix. We're racing today then at Interlagos, a historic 2.7 mile circuit, and one of the few anti-clockwise tracks on the calendar. 15 corners in total, nine to the left and six to the right, with a technical middle section opening up to a flat out sector three. That gives us our best passing opportunity down into turn one. Anthony Davidson is here once again for today's Grand Prix. Let's talk about Morgan. That was a great podium in the last race. So can they keep that momentum going this weekend? It's always nice to come into a Grand Prix weekend on a high, but your expectations are based much more on your practice and qualifying runs. So it's the momentum from those sessions that they'll be hoping to carry into the race today. It's time to take a look at our starting grid for today's race. Valtteri Bottas lines up on pole position and Lewis Hamilton completes the front row. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Morgan, Leclerc, Sebastian Vettel and Verstappen, Ricardo, Ocon, Sainz and Sergio Perez, Stroll, Kvyat, Antonio Giovinazzi and Norris, Raikkonen, Grosjean, George Russell and Kevin Magnussen. Latifi, Gasly, they've taken a grid penalty. Albon and Louis Delatraz. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out. Then let's see who can prevail today. But they're like, races can be won. No, races w can't be won on the start, but definitely races can be lost on the start. I think, yeah, I don't know who said that, but yeah, I think it was, if I'm not mistaken, it was Nicky Lauda, so I think it was an interview where I explained that. And there's something I always think about, so like, I have to capitalize on the first lap uh, from the get go. And it just reminds me of like last year as well, where Valtteri Bottas just stormed through the track. I think it was, um, it was in Suzuka. So guys, like, Let's just check like the strategy. So it says if I pit lap number lap number eleven, yo, like the tires are, are are they like the soft tires are they durable at that to point where they can just put up a fight like that? I don't want that to happen. So, but either way, it seems like I will i will be running like the soft tires um i mean like the, the soft tires quite longer compared to the like to the medium tires so the second stint is what i'm trying to say let's just check now so we're still at about 18. let me just see if i pick it up 11. Mm, okay Lep, i mean like lap number seven so if I pit lap number seven, like the tires will be basically off at the like probably just at the end of that. So wait, let's go on second. I don't want to do something. This doesn't make sense now. Yeah. So it favors me pitting lap number five. 
for me like lap number seven but like i'm going to run that long with the soft tires that doesn't make sense to me it doesn't make sense to me um i'm thinking now i'm just like brainstorming one just one last time and then yeah but it doesn't make sense to me i think i kind of understand why but it doesn't make sense to collect um and if you think about like the fastest strategy that we actually have it can it can actually give us a very very good momentum so let me see if i beat lap number six what happens nope lap number nine that's what happens nah i still like losing a lot of time okay okay i'll stick to this but at the end i won't have enough rubber that's one thing i can confirm with you guys but yeah you should see i'm ready and i'm excited so let's do it The teammate behind is 13.8 seconds.
is moving to mix two, fuel to mix two. is ahead of you, second place, you're in second place, our gap to the car in front is 1.7 seconds, they're on old softs, Leclerc behind, the gap is less than a second, pit window opens in 5 laps time, 5 laps, 14 laps to go.
to the car ahead is increasing by a few tenths per lap. Sat in P2. Bottas ahead. Okay, gap ahead is 1.9 seconds. They're on old softs. Leclerc is behind you. Less than a second separate you. They're on old softs. Confirmed. We'll receive you at the end of this lap. overtake and burn some of this energy. Louis is coming in for his stop. off our excess fuel. We'll be back on target soon. Don't wait too long to turn the engine down. Gap to car in front is 2.0 seconds.
five laps of fuel remaining. Caution, caution. Okay, clear. Good work, great pass. Three laps of fuel remaining. Bottas is behind you. You are in first position. Front of the pack, the gap behind us is 2.4 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. Look after these tires now. We want to finish the race on this compound. Two laps left. Next time by will be your final lap. Tire condition is still looking good.
need to worry about tire condition for now. Everything's looking good. This is your final lap, final lap of the race. Than a lap of fuel now. The tank is empty. Drive. We did it. Good job. It's certainly been an incredible year for Formula One, and our drivers have all pushed themselves this season, making it one of the most compelling years of racing in history. There can only be one champion, however, and here they are now, our new Formula One World Drivers' Champion. We've witnessed some great battles around the historic curves of Interlagos today, and they've taken a fantastic win. Talk to me, Ants. What was it that set them apart from the competition today? Well, this was a real team victory. They put together a solid strategy today that appeared well suited to the conditions out on track. The driver did everything that was expected of them in the moment to really execute the team's plan to perfection. A shining example of how F1 really is a team sport. The faces on our top three look so incredibly happy as they make their way up to the podium. A much deserved victory and a brilliant performance from them all. Now, let's discuss, Ants. Who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? That's got to be the Flying Finn. Wait, how many Flying Fins have we had now? Anyway, I'm talking about Bottas this time. Just great raw speed and a good job in traffic as well. It's another clear win for Mercedes as they manage to secure the Constructors' title. An incredible performance for the whole team. After an event like that, who knows what the sport has in store for us next time. Be sure to join us again as we continue to bring you the latest excitement in Formula One. So yeah, guys, um, um, amazing race indeed for us. Um, yeah, I must say that I actually struggled a bit from the beginning. And I think we said to confess that if only I didn't qualify higher, I was not going to win the race. And I was not, I was not even going to make at least like the top five because... Yeah, like the guys were insanely quick like the speed was just on point and i feel like you know what i'm going to use this to, to my advantage but yeah but like one thing i realized that the only time where i actually lose uh time in terms of like lap time it's when like it, i think it's more of my my breaking point oh i tend to break a lot and every time whenever i break a lot like i lose a couple of tenths and then uh, I keep on like repeating the same thing over and over like the lap, which means uh, I basically like, end up losing two, three, four, five seconds. So yeah, but again, man, it is just still me trying to learn the game. Uh, I really want to play this game more and more and more. I really want to be better. So, but yeah, like the strategy was on point, and, and also like, the patient was also on point because yeah, I, I, I feel like Valtteri at the end of the day. He should have, he should have just let me pass. Yeah, I'm sorry, but yeah, 
he, he should just let me pass because he saw us coming and like, there was no way I was not going to send it there. But yeah, it it, it, it really worked for us and I am really happy with the way things panned out and yeah. We won the race. I think this is our second victory. Second or third, I'm not sure. Second I think. Uh let's check where Louis the Latres is. So Louis is basically P twenty yeah, from P twenty two. Yeah, I think I might have to substitute him so that like, I can make like, like yeah, at least the the team to get more points uh, in a sense. So yeah, I don't know, but we should see. But like the driver that I want, it will be Charles Leclerc, because I know he's probably gonna be quicker than me. Or no, Charles o only Charles Leclerc. That's the driver that I need. I thought I was going to take Pierre Gasly, but you see, he was just way behind. So. Guys, just, just just give me one second before we advance. So yeah, guys. Um, yeah, the highlights are done. Let's just continue. But uh, man, I'm feeling tired again. But imagine, like, do you have people who are racing uh 100% of like I think it's like the race land. Yo, mad respect to those people. Cause I can't even I can barely maintain the 25%. Like my feet will start complaining but yeah the fans really seem to enjoy that it made it look easy I try my best yeah how are you feeling after that win yeah I feel amazing for sure I feel fantastic dude but it's nope uh team okay for our investment to our aerodynamics paid off nope I'll say this time around ideally I should be saying durability that's something that I really really want to but I'll say power on units, but yeah, a super You're breaking all expectations. What's your secret? Ah, let me see. Not so good. Let's have a great team and a good car for sure. Things are looking up after last week, aren't they? Definitely. I'm uh, not gonna lie about that. Definitely the reliability issue we had. Nice. Uh, aerodynamics? No. Durability is something that I want to really invest in. It wasn't my the time cleanest on. race today, was it? No, it was not. None of. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, 100%. Appreciate your time. No problem. But yeah, it was a good race from us, so. I'm not gonna lie, sit here and say it was not a good race. It was a very, very good race indeed. Uh, we tried everything we could. I just said, like, I felt quicker on this track. I, I know I always said that, but yeah, on this one, I felt really, really quick. Like, I felt really, really quick. So, it actually worked for us. But yeah, just want to see how much we got. Um, yeah, Louis has to go. I don't know why, like, I feel that way now, and it's terrible, but yeah. Really, really, like, need a teammate that's going to be able to help us to get these points. We should have got 1.7 million dollars. <laughs> That's what you're talking about. Ah, oh, and we almost got 100k. That is good. So now we're sitting at about 20 million dollars. Yep. We managed to save money, dude. Like, we have 20 million before the end of the... Um, what do you call this? Jesus Christ. Before the end of the season. That is big. So yeah, I'm not quite sure uh, how much time will I have before, like, oh, is it maybe I'll just say like after the preseason testing <sighs> to actually make Morning, some boss. upgrades. So this yeah. week's income from the sponsors has cleared, and we're making good profit against our running costs. Nice. That's what I like to hear. So let's see this. Hmm. We have that. Nope. Nope. Mm, nope. Nope. Yes and yes. So I'm basically going to be taking one, two. Maybe their promotion. Okay, I'll see up. I'll see about that one. But yeah, let's see. Yeah, our car is performing really, really well. To be fair, honest. But yeah, but like oh, we also we also have a good pace. So. I feel like that as well is also participating big for the team, so yeah. 
arrow and shut this. All right, let's check the gearbox way because I just changed it. 27 percent, and I'm only just like left with one race, so we're looking good out here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I've spoiled us. I'm actually like, I'm, I'm, I'm still waiting on my 13 million dollars. Like that, just, that is guaranteed for like they yeah, are for the team. So yeah. This is big and this is very very huge for the team. I'm not gonna lie to you. So we can actually afford even Lewis Hamilton now. But I am not going to bother myself and go for an expensive driver. I want Charles Leclerc. Yeah, it seems like the, their prices are keep on going up and up because Charles was was how much? He was nine. It was nine million dollars, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he was nine million dollars. So like now he's twelve million. This is not gonna be good for the team, but. Oh man, yeah, Whew. I'm feeling tired. Yeah, we have a lot of money before the end of the season, so yeah, this is this is this is really good. So yeah, no, no constructors champion. Um, we are still gonna stay fourth, of which it's, it's good. Uh, but in terms of the drivers' championship, Valtteri Bottas already secured his win. He is sorted. But I believe actually I can no 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 I can't surpass any of those t those four drivers in front. So I am really happy with the way the way I am currently. And yeah, with the, like the fact that I got Max Verstappen, this is it's really really good. So yeah, so this is our second victory. We actually came close on a couple of races to into winning. Like yeah, but yeah, we are looking pretty solid right now we're looking very very good so yeah i'm really happy with this okay guys cool so thank you so much for watching once again uh really means that to me it's the very same guy i'm called dan shalom for the one boot to aka okay exit say this with you guys so i think i love you and i'll probably see you guys on the next one cheers i'm signing out right now man 16 november monday i'll catch you guys next time cheers i'm out of here